The South Fork Eel River today has yielded a lot of tracks. And uh, the really cool trail right here is that of this mink right here. And the mink is going along. I hope the wind isn't ruining the audio on this too much. But the mink is heading along there. Then we have this frog track right here, which is incredibly cool. And that's on top of a turkey track. Here's a close-up of the mink. Then you have these guys, which have these outer toes that kind of bow inwards. Those are goose tracks. There's this invertebrate track. And then over here, an otter has come out of the water and gone up here next to the turkey tracks. So you see here you have the turkey and there you have the goose tracks. So notice how the turkeys have straighter toes and the geese have outer toes that bend inwards towards the center line of the trail. Here is that mink making a fantastic trail right through the center there. And at least one otter right here going that way. And then these little tiny bird tracks over here. These are the tracks of a spotted sandpiper. Compare the size of those to these giant ones from the, the geese. And then over here, there's a gray fox track, or set of tracks. It's a front with a hind on top of it. And the gray fox is heading that direction. So much variety out here right now. Here's a nice close-up of an otter track. Look at that beautiful track. You can see the carpal pad here. You can see all five toes. Really beautiful. And then up here on this drier sand, you can see the, uh, the otter going that direction. And look at the size of these huge goose tracks. So this is why... There's the size. This is why the goose tracks have the outer toes bent inward because they have feet that have webbing on them. The turkeys don't have that, so the turkeys have straight toes. Here's our mink, but it's not a great track. You can see these nice goose tracks right here. They were here last night. I heard them down along the river, and I saw three of them fly over last night. So I know these geese were around recently. Those are some giant tracks. Well, that's a, a pretty good overview of what's down here, and that's just a small sampling. That doesn't even count the deer and the ravens whose tracks are up there, but that's just a little short section of sand on the river's edge here at the South Fork Eel River. Hope you enjoyed.